Hi, so if you have actually gotten your Google AdWords account suspended multiple times, even after creating new accounts, and at the end of the day or after a few days, do you all get suspended? Then this video is going to provide a solution for you. So um, some people have actually had this problem that when they create an account and they use the account for a while, and then they get this notification in the dashboard telling them that their account is suspended, probably because of suspicious payment activity or whatever they call it. Now, in this video, I'm going to tell you exactly why you may be getting such problem in your Google AdWords account because I myself, I have actually encountered these problems. In fact, I have created numerous Google AdWords accounts trying new ways that i can use to bypass this but at the end of the day i found out that it is merely impossible to actually find a working method also if you are someone that tried using vpn to create a new google adwords account you will know that that didn't work because your account ended up getting suspended as well and that is because technology is evolving every single day and whatever step you're trying to take they are going to know lying might actually jeopardize your account and it might get suspended so the best way to actually solve this problem is by following the rules and i'm going to let you in in those rules shortly one of the reasons you may be getting this problem is because your payment method is automatic you've actually selected automatic method that means google awards is going to give you a particular threshold let's say 25 dollars to exhaust before you can actually make this payment it means they give you a credit to actually use before you can actually pay so if your account and when you're creating a new account and you select to pay via automatic method then there is a high chance that your account is going to be suspended because what this means is that they do not trust you well enough to give you an account or to give you a balance to actually use before you make payment and another reason is you are not actually selecting your country let's say i am from nigeria and when i'm selecting my country i select united states because along the line, when you are creating a new Google AdWords account, you get to this payment profile section and it will ask you to enter more details about yourself. And in your country section, you might have entered the United States or any other country apart from your own country. I'm from Nigeria and I'm entering United States. This is one of the problems and that is why they are suspending your account and it is not really a suspicious payment as they usually target. It's just a general word for them to use to suspend your account but that can mean many things that are not even related to suspicious payment because your card might be brand new you just got it from the bank i mean it's your own but then they're saying fraudulent payment suspicious payment it doesn't even relate to that it is because you were not selecting your real country. And that is why in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how I was able to create an account and just specific places where you should actually pay more attention when creating your Google AdWords account. So this method is actually what I did. And now I've been able to use Google AdWords successfully, no problems. Right, so I'm just going to show you how to do that. Now, this is the last section when you are setting up your Google AdWords account. And this section usually determines whether your account is going to get suspended in the coming days or not. And that is why you will have to prioritize this section and make sure that whichever details you are entering here is very accurate. Now, starting from the billing country, which is United States, if your country is not United States, you will have to click on the drop down and select what your country is. Now, most countries only have one payment method, and that is automatic payment. They usually don't have manual payment. 
But if your ad account is getting suspended often and on and you are not selecting your real country. Now, what you have to do is to click on the drop down and select your country and my country is Nigeria. So um, let's select Nigeria. And when you do that, the time zone will be selected by default, which is the Nigerian time. And if you have a promotional code, you can go ahead and enter that. And when you scroll to the bottom of the page, you are going to see a heading which says how you pay. And you are going to see two payment methods, which are automatic payments and manual payments. So after selecting your real country and you have these two payment methods, the best you will do is to select manual payments. Now, the downside of this is that you are not going to be getting any threshold, meaning you're not going to get a free $50 to use to run adverts before you can pay. Now, this manual payments means you will have to fund your account before you run advert and after your balance exhausts, your ads will stop going and you will have to fund it again to continue running your advert. So this is more like a pay as you go feature. So uh, if you don't want your account to keep getting suspended, be sure to select manual payment. All right. So um, you can start with 10. Right. So this is the minimum um, amount that they allow if you want to fund your account. So when you've done that, you can enter your payment method, which is your credit card or debit card details, and then click on submit. So these two main things are the things that you should prioritize when you get to this final section, which are first your billing country and second manual payment. So when you've done that, select all of that currently and then click on the submit button. But now in the coming days, um, Google, Google AdWords might suspend your account telling you to verify or appeal. Right, and when you do this appeal, do it correctly. Tell them all the details correctly. Tell them what happened, the last money that you funded in your account. You know, if you have appealed for a suspended Google AdWords account, you know the questions that they usually ask you. So make sure to answer these questions correctly and your account will be reinstated in a few days and they'll tell you that they asked for these details just to get to know you more. And after this verification, you can start using your account for as long as you want. And also don't forget to let me know in the comment section if you followed this guide and it worked for you.